Hello everybody and welcome back to a new Grotech Fangham tutorial and in today's tutorial I'm going to show you how to add turning to a Grotech Fangham pretty easy and also how you can make it save like if you like click enable it's gonna be enabled when you restart the game the same with disable so yeah in your package manager in project you should probably have the XR interaction toolkit but we don't want this uh, because you probably have the new version going to be 3 point something just hit remove and go to the link in the description, it's going to be this thing. Scroll down until you see this version here, the 2.5.4 and hit add version by name. Now this is going to happen, just hit add. Make sure that you have removed it before and then you want to, after like installed back again, you, know, you probably have started assets installed so you just want to just hit re-import or even import again. Then. It's just gonna work because without this, the old versions have this thing which is actually required, but the new versions are really bad and you can't even do it anymore. Yeah, that's why we're just gonna use this one. So I'm gonna go to snap turn, like make it just an empty game object, call it snap turn. Let's <coughs> now turn it like this, then add there and uh, snap turn. Now you just want to add that the snap turn provider with a locomotion system. At least it's asking for that, so go to Gorilla Rig and add the locomotion system. Now it asks you for XR origin and and you probably may even use the XR rig still, so you wanna just add the, the XR origin like this. I already have it. And if you have the XR rig all still on, just remove it then add it. And just set it up like this here, exactly like this. And yeah, now we want to go to snap turn. Drag in the gorilla rig as a locomotion controller. It's gonna be the right hand, because you probably want to do it with the right hand joystick. I would usually turn this one off. So basically what it does is when you put your joystick to the back, it's, it's gonna instantly do this. You guys can do the rest by yourself. It's pretty easy, I think, to understand this. And yeah, then let's go to the saving. So I'm gonna enable this old thing. I'm just gonna make this thing here now. I'm not really gonna do this. But here, if you guys go to my disk server, you just gonna scroll down to save, enable, disable. The script, by the way, was not made by me, I just started it in random disk, so... Now, on your cube, or whatever it is, just go ahead and add the save, enable, disable script. Multiple. Um, now, the object to disable, if there's no disable button, put your snap turn on. If it's the enable button, put it the enable, and then like this. Yeah, that's how it works, it actually saves. And yeah, bye bye, love you all, and see you in the next video.